today, class, we're going to be learning about the 50 states. So I hope everyone did their homework class, right? Um, oh, here comes Pete. Sorry. Oh yeah, the whole Here, here, here. Sorry, sorry. So, uh, Pete, do you uh, remember anything from the homework? Uh, yeah. So, I do. But you, you said, you said in the homework that I, I have a problem with something. You said that there's 50 states, but there's clearly only 49 states. So I'm not sure what you were saying. Pete, there's 50 states, man. I'll prove right here. Yesterday. Wait, hold on, man. I remember Garfield saying something about this. Yes, it must be true. The show that tells you all sorts of incredible things, which, since they're on television, must be true. And now, the host of It Must Be True, Garfield the Cat. Thank you, thank you. We have a great show for you tonight, folks. And I just want to remind you of our motto. If they say it on television, it must be true. Here's our first incredible revelation. There's no such place as Wyoming. Think about it. Have you ever met anyone from Wyoming? No, now that you mention it, I don't think I really remember. Well, there you are. The myth of Wyoming began in the year 1789, when the great explorer and mapmaker Arbuckle Vespucci was designing the United States. I left a teensy tiny little square empty out here, and I'm all out of the states. Hmm, no more states, uh huh? How about another a Carolina? No, I know. And so the cat wrote in Wyoming, an old Italian word meaning no state here. Wow. If it's on TV, it must be true. Yeah. So what are you talking about, Mr. Yeah. Mr. White? What's his name? What's his name? Mr. Nate. Mr. Nate. Mr. Mr. Nate. Nate. What are you talking about, man? Huh. There's really young bulls out here thinking that Wyoming exists? I never even thought about that. Ever since I was a young child, in my books and in the puzzle games, Wyoming's just always been a void. For other people, it was completely different. I'm dumbfounded, flabbergasted, and I don't understand what's happening right now. I don't understand what's happening right now. I need answers! Oh, it's Joe! What's up? What's up? Alright, what do you need help with? Oh, I'm trying to prove why Wyoming doesn't exist. All right, walk with me, walk with me. All right. Walk! Okay. All right. Now, look at this map. Yes. What do you see? Countries. Or the continents. Yes, 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 yes. But what does that say? The United States. And do you see Wyoming anywhere on this? I do not. Of course you don't. And why do you see that? Because it doesn't exist. Exactly! Yeah! Because the dozens yeah. of yeah. 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 you don't say anything from Wyoming! Now go out with the question! Two hours later. Ugh, oh, well, I already got one piece of good advice. Who else can I interview? Amen! <gasps> What's up, A1 Dan, the man? <laughs> Bars. Do, do, do you need assistance? Yeah, um, I'm trying to figure out why uh, the big W doesn't exist. Wyoming, W. Wyoming. Yeah. Wow, well. Have you heard about the cats that fell? Nah, nah. As the great Greek philosopher, Mr. Confucius once said, when the cats fall in the stream and there's the head, would you with your arm and wouldn't you for? 
Oh, uh, did you see how does Ninjago? No. Well, Ninjago, no. With the Bionicle and the arm with, or would you, with four on November 3rd? That's what she said. I mean, I think you got your answer right there. Huh. That's it. The cats. Wyoming doesn't have any cats. <laughs> Three twenty eight AM. Teaching going. Yo, Pete, what are you doing this early? Wait, 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 wait. wait. I have it. I stay, I stay here, here all night all after, school, after school, school trying, trying to figure out why land doesn't exist because I don't know, I don't know it's, true. it's true. Pete, there's 50 states, man. I'm pretty great. If it's on TV, it must be true. It must be true. And do you see Wyoming anywhere on this? Wyoming I. Wyoming is imaginary. Huh. I see. I never thought of it like that. Because one X ten Michael Jackson, why boop the say Wyoming. I it must not exist. And that's why That's why it's why. That's why it's just a void. It, it can't exist. We gotta tell the whole world. You're getting it now, Nick. Now you understand why Wyoming doesn't exist. From Tampa Bay Screening News Leader, brought to you by AlertTodayFlorida.com, this is ABC Action News. Yeah, I don't know why you're calling me. I mean, I just said we had a show like 20 times. Wait, are we? Action News reporting from Las Vegas, Nevada. Reportedly, multiple students have reported that Wyoming doesn't exist. Mainly, student junior at the Christian Academy, Peter Cavassini. He has reportedly said and given evidence over the three-decade-old show, Garfield. You weren't expecting that. And what he claims is, if it's on TV, it must be true. We'll get back to you when more reporters have found more evidence. Until then, back to you, Eugene. This is ABC Action News. All right, are we done now? I think we're done. What the? I figured it out! I figured it out! Pete, I figured Pete, it out! Pete, you're a clown. You really think that Wyoming doesn't exist? What kind of much of a fool you've made of yourself? What did you say? Pete, I'm not a fool. I'm just trying to Stop being a fool of me! Stop! Over and out!